Change the Rebel Mascot. That is the name of a new petition asking the Franklin County Board of Education to get rid of the Colonel mascot at their high school. But shortly after the organizer made the petition, a counter petition started. News Force Carice Jackman with both sides tonight. Racism has been alive in Winchester for so long. Shanae Williams attended Franklin County High School. One thing that never sat well with her, this rebel colonel mascot. I'm, I'm an African-American woman. I don't feel like my mascot for the only high school in my town should be a Confederate man. It's why she's making a major effort to get things changed. After seeing people come together in her county for a peaceful protest, William says now is the perfect time for her community to take action. They just had a protest to show unity. I make a petition to change something that has hurt many African Americans in, in Franklin County. Not just African Americans, it's hurt white people, Asians, Hispanics. It's been insulting to Franklin County. More than 1,400 people have signed up in support of her cause. But not everyone feels the same way. A counter petition is now up called Saving the Rebel Mascot at Franklin County High School. On the page, it says removing the Franklin County High School mascot will not solve a national crisis, referring to the protests across the country, calling for police reform over the death of George Floyd. The Save the Rebel mascot petition now has over 700 signatures. We took Williams's concerns to director of school Stanley Bean. Can you see or understand why? Because I, I know I sent the link to the petition to you. Can you all see and understand why many people have signed that petition one, he's wanting to see the rebel mascot come down and what it means to many people, especially African Americans. I can't answer how they feel or why they feel that way because uh, I'm not. Uh, and I don't mean that in a negative way at all. Bean says he's only recently heard of both petitions and is looking into the concerns, but says ultimately it's up to the board to decide. Uh, a lot of times I can't find a community that I love so much. And that's what bothers me because I, I care deeply about this county. And hate to see either, you know, any group of people um, hurt by this. And I know these things will hurt people on both sides. As for Williams, she plans on taking that petition to the next school board meeting. I feel like if we're really going to move forward, not just in Franklin County, but in America, we have to start with ourselves. So I have to start with my town. I'm Carice Jackman, News 4 Nashville. News 4 contacted the people in charge of the petition who support keeping the rebel mascot. We're waiting to hear back from them. News 4 also reached out to the members of the Board of Education, and we're still waiting on a response from them as well.